Welcome to GCraft 101. My name is Sahani and I will show you how to do a few commands. The first thing I will do is the moderator's rollback, which is used for griefing. Um, you will need two commands, and the first one is CO inspect, the second one is rollback. So if we go over here, I have already prepared a place that I have made and also griefed a bit. So, first of all, you put on inspect by saying slash co inspect. Good, it's enabled. Now, if you click any block, it tells you what the block ID is, who was placed by, and when. So, I placed that block 33 minutes ago. And this one, for example, no one has placed it. And if you, as you can clearly see, that's missing a block here. I'm placing a block, it will tell you the block ID and who will remove the block from the spot and when. And I know for a fact there was no block here, so it will say no block was removed. Now, you want to roll this back. And the way you do that is by saying slash co roll back the time, which is when it was removed, 0 0.5 minutes ago, uh, 0 0.01 hours ago, but I normally just say slash co one h that's one min uh, sorry, 10 minutes. Then you say you, that's the griefer, in this case myself. And the radius is the radius around you to each side that it will um, register. So let's just say 15. Let's try this. Boom, boom. It's back to uh, its original shape. So n now you have fixed the grief, and if you want to, you can ban the player. Now, if if the player have placed blocks, like that one for example, then you can do the same, and just change the time, I just have to change the time here, to 0 0.4 hours. Now, boom, it removes the blocks the person have placed. And that is how simple you can fix a grief. Uh, the time goes up to a thousand hours, I believe, so <laughs> that's a lot of days you have to find the grief and then you can fix it. Now you have to remember to say slash co inspect again to turn it off, else you can place or break blocks. And that is fun stuff, being a fool. That was all for now. Next one will be incoming soon.